We're glad you joined us for Overflow today, where we take five minutes to talk about how your walk with Christ can overflow into your relationship with your non-Christian friends. Lee Strobel is a former investigative reporter for the Chicago Tribune. He's also a former atheist. Strobel told us recently how DNA discoveries give scientific evidence for an intelligent designer of life. I think one of the discoveries that points powerfully toward the existence of a creator is DNA. DNA inside every cell is encoded with the precise assembly instructions for all of the proteins out of which we're made. This is information. Nature cannot produce information. If you're walking along a beach and you see ripples in the sand, you might say, well, the waves cause those ripples because nature can do that. But if you're walking down the beach and you see John loves Mary and a heart around it and an arrow through it, you wouldn't say the waves made that. Why? Because it's information. It's a message with content. Well, inside every cell in our body is DNA. What is DNA? Made, this is made up of a four-letter chemical alphabet that spells out the precise assembly instructions for every protein out of which we're made. Well, whenever we see information, whether it's in a newspaper, a book, a computer code, a painting on a cave wall, whatever, whenever we see information, we always know there's an intelligence behind it. And so when we see information in a cell, that doesn't point toward natural selection acting on random variations over time. I and mean, that can't explain how information comes about. Information always has intelligence behind it. And that's why Stephen C. Meyer, who has a PhD in um, uh, origin of life issues from Cambridge University, has written the book uh, Signature in the Cell to point toward information as being evidence that there is a creator. Okay, one question. With such compelling evidence, why is faith still needed? Yeah, as an atheist, when I investigated the evidence of science, cosmology, physics, biochemistry, genetics, human consciousness, astronomy, and so forth, they point, the evidence points in a direction. Um, is it conclusive proof, like mathematical proof? Well, I'm not saying it is. What I am saying, though, is they, there's arrows that point in a direction, and I believe that direction is in the direction of a creator. The name of Lee Strobel's book is The Case for a Creator. It's a great read with a lot of scientific evidence. Well, that's it for this edition of Overflow Today. Remember, all of our shows and the small group discussion guides that go along with these shows are always available for free on our website, overflowtoday.com. Now go pour into someone's life.